A crisis in social media can come out of nowhere. Your best chance to make it through is to be prepared. Effective social media crisis management starts long before any issues arise. You need to make a plan and detail exactly what to do so that you can react. Have a solid plan, a list of key stakeholders and responsibilities, and a clear chain of command. Here's a quick example. For the Royal Oak, they have a crisis management plan. They have a number of different examples of a potential crisis, such as a COVID outbreak, a power cut, water leak, maybe an influential difficult customer, or food poisoning. Who can prepare and or sign off our response on social media? That falls down to two people and here are their mobile numbers. Ideally, these people will make a written statement, but it could also be a video response. Also, there's a note here to check all scheduled messages in Creator Studio to ensure nothing insensitive is going out on Instagram and Facebook during the time of the crisis. Follow this five-step plan in order to deal with any social media crisis that may arise. Firstly, detect. Make sure you're listening in social media. Keep an eye on your notifications, what you get tagged in, and any mentions of your brand online. For example, you might do a daily search on Twitter for the name of your pub, just to check to see what kind of content is appearing. This way you can spot anything before it goes viral. Number two, identify. Figure out what has happened and who you need to speak to in order to get a clear idea on the issue. For example, what happened? Why did it happen? And how can it be resolved? Number three, consider. What's your approach? Consider your tone of voice and responding in a timely way. Will you be responding publicly or privately? Will you need to make a statement in a post or a video? You could make a quick live video reaction if you felt comfortable, or it could be something that's filmed and then uploaded to various social media sites if appropriate. Number four, response. Ensure you respond on all appropriate channels. You could train a few staff to help manage messages and comments on your social media so it doesn't fall to one person, particularly if you do need to respond to a large amount. Ensure all scheduled posts are paused for the time being and keep monitoring the situation and make a call on when you think the crisis has calmed down. So to recap, approach any social media crisis with the following steps. The first is to detect. Make sure you're listening in social media. Then identify, figure out exactly what's happened, who you need to speak with in order to get a clear idea on the issue and anyone else involved. Number three, consider. What is your approach? And number four, response ensure you're responding on all appropriate social media channels in a timely manner. And number five is to learn. Take time to debrief and examine exactly what happened. Get the whole company together to talk about the experience that you've all been through and share knowledge and experiences from different teams. This will help you to learn about the best steps you can take in the future.